Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to achieve this gorgeous watercolour manicure in lovely pastel shades. And what I've done, I've left two nails free, so I'm going to show you how to do that. So as my base, I've used CND Shellac in Cream Puff. But obviously if you're doing this in normal polish, just any white will do. And then for my pastel shades, I've got this gorgeous mint, which is mint convertible, a lilac longing, and cake pop. So any pastel shades I think would work really well with this. And then you're also going to be needing a tile or some foil and then just decant your colours onto that. And then a dotting tool. And bizarrely enough, you're going to be needing a plastic bag. Now this is just a regular Ziploc bag and I'll show you what I'm going to be doing with it later. Right, so let's get started. Um, I'm just going to just go along and then randomly place it in blobs on the nail. So I'll show you with this one first. It's got some fluff on there. So you don't want to apply it too thick because you don't want it to wrinkle in the lamp. And you want to sort of spread it out slightly. And then just place it in random places. Try and leave a rim of white around the edge. And I'll show you why in a minute. Right, so there's the splodges. And now all I'm going to do is take this plastic bag and I'm going to place my finger like that. And I'm just going to fold it over. And then all you're going to do is just lightly press down like this. And then open it up carefully. And then what you're left with is this gorgeous design. And then when you top coat it, it'll look even better. So I, I think I've got a bit too much purple here. So I'm just going to go back, fold it over again, smush it down a bit more just to get a bit more of a blended effect. And then there you go. So I'll show you again on the other nail. As I say, you can do this with any colours that you like. But I think if you're going for a spring-like manicure, I think pastel colours work really nicely with this. Because it gives it more of a watercolour picture effect. So just randomly dab it on. And the good thing about this is you don't need to be too neat because obviously each nail is going to be different. But that's the beauty of the, uh, the look, I think. Right, so I'm just going to get my bag again. Like that. And then I'm just going to fold it over. And then just really gently tap it all over the nail. Lift it up gently, and then there's the watercolour. And obviously if you get any on your skin, just remove it with a wood stick. Right, so I'm going to go and cure that now and top coat it, and then I'll come Okay, back. right, I've cured the colours, and then I top coated it and wiped off the inhibition layer. And then I just applied my solar oil. And I just absolutely love how it turns out, and that every single nail is different. So have a play guys, you can do literally any colour with this. And if the plastic bag method isn't for you, then you could try just cutting off little pieces of sponge and then using tweezers to dab the colour on, if that's more appropriate for you. Or you could use these disposable um, eyeshadow applicators and just dab the colour on like that. And just see what effects you get. 
I think with the plastic bag, it you get more of a blended effect. So that's why I like that. Um, so yeah, I am on Instagram and I am at the real Mrs. Gray, G R E Y, if you wanted to follow me on there. And you can also send me any requests either through YouTube or on Instagram and um, let me know if there's any that you'd like me to do. Thanks for watching, guys. Take care.